What's up, guys? How close is it? That's what I'm making, y'all. Fried fish. <laughs> we go from not frying. It's still once a week. What you doing, boy? Fried fish dance. Fried fish dance. Fried fish dance. Fried fish dance. So, I'll be burning the fries. No, you burning the fries. So, fried fish, shrimp, french fries for dinner. Jordan is sleeping. Aiden outside. Me and Hope are in the house chilling. Listen to music. Hey, 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 hey. Yeah, I'm supposed to wash my hair today. I think that's gonna happen tomorrow. Look. This is what he do, burn the french fries. I'm not burning, you said, I clearly told you I was burning them and then you was like, you burning them. And I was like, okay, you have the tongs. You want me to use my hands? But what you doing? I love you. you can't buckle that. About to leave, already packing. Come with me, I'm not really asking. One, we'll get two. Away. That was a little fast, huh? We almost flew off. Come on, brother. She's like, let's go. So the park was fun. Y'all got hot fast. Yesterday, me and Hubster, <laughs> we was sitting. Now I'm watching TV and I was like, ooh, man, I was like, tomorrow will be cool if we get up early and take the kids to the park in the morning. And then I started laughing saying, well, Nikki, um, you're the one that needs to focus with life and get your butt up. Everybody else be up. <laughs> so he started laughing. Cause that'd be me, you know, I'll be having ideas. But I'm like, yeah, we can get up early. So <laughs> we did get up early. Um, Jordan actually slept in. I want to say she got up at like 8 and then I got up at 9. Um, and then we got dressed, went to the park. Y'all, we probably should have got up at like 7, got to the park at like 8 because it was hot. <laughs> it was hot. But Jordan loves being outside. Like she was trying to, she was all on the big kids park, uh, playground park. And of course that got more like little holes around it. So we watching her. She just likes to climb. She had a good time. Ada had fun. Um, a dad and his two sons had came and they had like this uh dang, what is it called? Stump rocket. Okay, they had a stump rocket where you put the rockets on and then you stump on the thing and the rockets go up in the air. So of course he went over there and was playing with them. So he had fun the latter part. But y'all, it was so flipping hot though. <laughs> and we was like, yeah. So these are gonna be our like on the weekends. If we go to the park, we're gonna have to go early now because things like too much. So she of course is taking a nap. She probably gonna sleep for like two hours. Um Hopster is barbecuing today. You day girl. So yeah, he barbecuing some ribs, chicken. I'm about to make some spaghetti. We went to Walmart. We had stopped in there before we came home. And they finally had this. I was watching the Davidson's and Tiffany was meant she had mentioned the strawberry time lemonade. Um the strawberry time. I'm sorry, the Country Time Strawberry Lemonade. And when I went in Walmart to get it, ours had, they had, they must have been sold out because they ain't had none, but Aiden saw it today. He was like, they got strawberry lemonade. So I was like, cool. <laughs> and it's really, it tastes really good too. Because he likes to get strawberry lemonade. He likes to get strawberry Sprite. So now what he think he gonna do is ask for some, uh, 
the lemon lime we got and try to mix it <laughs> with the strawberry flavor. I wouldn't be surprised if he did that. Um, but yeah, so that's it. He has that plan, even though it's hot. It's like what's the temperature? Ninety-two. Ninety-two. It's not ninety-two. It's 90 degrees, y'all. I ain't ready. So, yeah, I had to switch the trash can. Jern stay her butt trying to dig in the dang on trash can. So, I went to Walmart yesterday and I picked up a new trash can. So, I got this one. So, she actually, like, has to learn to press that. And it's actually really, like, um, like, it's not loose. So, she ain't figured it out. She know it's new. She comes on here, over here and taps it because she know it open. But she ain't figured it out yet. So hopefully she don't figure it out too fast. I'm going to get the little one that stepped. But I was like, no, nah, she going to figure that out. But yeah, I had to because I'm like, child, stay out the trash. So I'm about to cook. I'm about to chop up my um vegetables, my bell pepper and onion for my spaghetti. And get the ground beef cooking. And I'm going to make... Um, corn on the cob and beans. together right so i went to walmart this this little thing was a dollar 97 i mean not dollar 97 a dollar 47 at walmart and it was funny because aiden had just asked me to um he's like we can use make you know ice pops juice you know he's like we could take juice and make ice pops so this is small this is more so for like journey because these they normally have them that's bigger i do think i have a few but i'm gonna take the um I'm gonna take the lemonade and I'll put some in there and I'm gonna make these. And I like these because Journey can like hold it on her finger, like a little ring pop. <laughs> so that'd be cool. But I thought he'll like it. I mean, Aiden, he'll, 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 um, Aiden will eat it too. Even though it's small, he'll probably eat like two or three of them. But I wanna show y'all this little cute little thing. So when I do my spaghetti, I ground my ground beef first and then I take my vegetables. Normally I have, um, mushrooms too to put in my spaghetti. But we didn't go to the other grocery store. And Walmart, they only sell like the really big container and we don't need that many. Um, our other grocery store, like you can get individual ones. So I get just the amount that I need because we don't eat mushrooms like that. And then I just take this and I brown. And I take the vegetables and then I just um, saute those. And then I add my meat back. And then I mix it, add some seasoning and stuff. So I know a lot of people like make their own spaghetti sauce. I haven't tried it yet, but I think I am going to try it. I've been telling hubby I want to make my own like uh, spaghetti sauce. But since I don't, this is the brand that I use. Hopefully it's been focused on. This is the classical brand. And I don't know where D is I'm assuming it's like from D Napoli. Here, let's see. So that's the brand that I use. Um, I saw this. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. It's inspired by the regions of Italy. So it's not from Italy, but it's inspired by. And this is really good. Like, I really like these. And they come in so many different flavors. This is tomato and basil. Um, the other one I have is Italian sausage. They got the four cheese. They have a uh, spiced roasted garlic and onion. So many different flavors. It tastes so it's better than Prego, Ragu, all them. Yeah. This is yes.
Man, you feel so good, dude. You good? Mm -hmm. So, dinner over, and Hubster, dinner is over, and Hubster went to go get dessert. He went to one store, they ain't had absolutely no strawberries, so he ended up going to Wally World. What? When Walmart comes through. <laughs> Buddy. So wait, it was no strawberries? Hey, that picture I sent you? Yeah. That was where all the strawberries go. Like it was literally no strawberries. Were strawberries on sale this week? I have no idea. But people thought they were on sale. They were gone. Look at wifey over there He's trying to get some uh worksheets and stuff. Um doesn't look like little man's gonna be going to school for a couple of weeks, so uh Babe over here is being proactive and just because he's not going to be in school does not mean he's not going to continue his education, which, you know, being a superstar wife she is, thinks about stuff like that. And um, that's cool. So at least for a couple of hours a day, he'll still be doing things. Um, you know, she's using some of that teaching that she was doing back in the day uh, to get his... Uh, continuous education so that's how we're taking the proactive solution um, we were just watching the news and he's talking about some of the kids going to um, like YMCA's and stuff like that it's kind of like a panic mode because you don't prepare for a strike so you don't know where you're gonna send your kids um, fortunately um, I'll probably work from home um, my job already sent an email out regarding this, so it's not much they could do if you can work from home. I think that's a good idea. Um, there's not much they could do because it's an unexpected thing. So, but yeah, she's printing out some uh, worksheets, downloading them so she could print them out. On uh, I think it's what K5 Learning. Yes, it's like, uh, K5 Learning. And it's just free worksheets that you can print out, um, that you can download and then just print out. So I'm just looking at like the different math that he's doing now just to continue, like to keep him just abreast of what he's doing. And I'm just happy that I'm hands on and you know, I don't just expect teachers to do everything. So that's basically said all that said, that's why I'm doing all this stuff. <laughs> but yeah, so it sucks. Hopefully it doesn't last long and they really, you know, kind of understand, you know, since it's a statewide thing and not just specific districts, like all the teachers feel the same way. Um, hopefully it doesn't last that long. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to comment down below. Welcome to all of our new subscribers. Comment down below and let me know if you're a subscriber and we find a channel at. I like to know. Um, but welcome to all of our new subscribers. Don't forget, comment down below, like, share. Make sure you guys tell a friend about this. If you have not hit that subscribe button for more videos here, follow me. And remember, if you love live vlogging, we'll talk to you guys tomorrow night. Night, y'all. Make good choices. Deuces. Beat the pro, folks.